Hi, Virgo. So you have throat chakra, okay? So your throat chakra is activated, okay? Um, your throat chakra is unblocked. It's not blocked. It is aligned, okay? Meaning you are you are able to express how you feel, okay? You have an outlet. You speak your mind, okay? Um, you're also willing to listen to what others have to say okay in the past your throat chakra or your uh, self-expression could have been blocked yeah but you've been um you've been nurturing it taking care of it okay you can be um you could be drinking like tea or something like that you could have lost your voice Maybe from a um, a common cold or uh, maybe from yelling or something like that. Maybe, I don't know, but, or speaking loud or you could have lost your voice, but you're getting it back. Yeah, you're taking care of your throat chakra. You're nurturing that part of yourself, Okay. Someone is actually, you could be practicing. You could be practicing um, positive self-talk. Okay. Or someone is um, speaking kinder to themselves. They're no longer putting themselves down or being self-critical. Yeah, someone is definitely taking good care of themselves or nurturing that part of themselves. You have moving on. Okay. And share the love. I feel like too, Virgo, you're saying exactly what you want to say, what you need to say. And then you're moving forward. Okay. Moving on and sharing the love. Someone wants to share something with you. They're hoping that you will open up. They're hoping that you'll share yourself with them. Or this could be like an exchange of ideas. You're not gossiping. But it's like you're sitting at the table with other people and you're discussing ideas. You're not discussing gossip. You're discussing ideas. Okay. But yeah, someone wants you to open up. I guess like to be more intimate. Yeah, love. But yeah, someone has been taking good care of themselves. It's like with heart with throat chakra here and nurture. I feel like you're also being cautious of what you say, how you say it, things like that, because you know that um maybe someone around you could take that personally or they could take what you say the wrong way. It's not that you're walking on eggshells. I mean, it could feel like you're walking on eggshells, but it's like you're being very careful of your words. Okay, yeah, you have rebuild. Someone wants to rebuild a connection with you. 
and they're going to express that. But it's like they're waiting for the right time to tell you this. This is someone that you've moved on from. They still think about you. Okay. Yeah, coming together. And then you have release. So I feel like although you have love for this person, maybe you don't want to rebuild the connection with this person. I feel like you've done enough healing, enough shadow work, and you refuse to go back to what broke you or, you know, any toxic environment or any toxic relationships. Yeah, you refuse to go back to that. Someone needs to release the idea of you two coming together. And someone could be afraid of that. Someone is afraid of letting go. Someone needs to release fear. I feel like someone just, someone, <coughs> sorry. Someone needs to release the thought or the fantasy of you two getting back together. They also need to release being afraid to let go. Yeah, someone is afraid of letting you go, Virgo. They don't know how to go with the flow. They don't know how to allow things to happen naturally. Okay. But it seems like they have no other no other choice. Okay, you have healing begins. Yeah, once this person releases this, they can start to heal. Okay. Actually, I'm hearing Taylor Swift. We're never getting back together or something like that. I think that's the name of the song. Never getting back together. Yeah, someone is hoping that you two can get back together. But they need to let that go because I don't think you feel the same way. And you may express that to them. Someone could have a problem with control. Okay. Manifest. Observe. I also see spell work. Okay. Someone is doing uh, spell work. Or rituals. And they're sitting back and they're observing to see if it's working. This could be a love spell. Yeah, they're awaiting results. But yeah, they're refusing to see that you've already moved on or this is something that you don't want. You don't want to rebuild a connection with them. Okay. All right, Virgo. So that is all for this message.